In this 3 minute tutorial, I will take you through a step by step guide on how to install VirtualBox version 7.0.2 on a Mac running macOS 11.7 Big Sur. VirtualBox is a powerful virtualization product for both enterprise as well as home use. It is actually a solution that is actively developed with frequent releases and has an ever growing list of features, supported guest operating systems, and platforms that it actually runs on. It is basically also a solution that allows users to extend their existing computer to run multiple operating systems, including Windows, Linux, Oracle Solaris at the same time. So the first thing I'm going to do is to show you how you can actually download the VirtualBox software from the official VirtualBox uh, website. So open up a new browser window and run a simple Google search for VirtualBox. And then on the returned search result, Click on the Oracle VM VirtualBox uh, search result. This should then open up the default uh, Oracle uh, homepage where you can actually start the download. So click on the download VirtualBox uh, 7 button and you should be redirected to the default downloads page. Click on the macOS Intel host link to download the uh, VirtualBox setup file for your MacBook. If you've got a latest M1 MacBook, then you can also click on the appropriate M1 link to get the download for your OS. So once your download is complete, the next thing that I'm going to do is to show you how you can actually open that .dmg file and complete the VirtualBox installation. So go to your downloads directory and then right click on the virtualbox.dmg file. Click on open with disk image mount. So you should now see a prompt telling you that the disk image mount is actually opening up the virtualbox.dmg file. Click on the virtualbox.pkg file. This should then open up the VirtualBox installation wizard. But before the wizard actually opens up, there's a prompt that you should see telling you that it's actually verifying the virtualbox.pkg file. And then once the wizard opens up, click on continue and then click on install. So you should actually see another prompt asking you to actually uh, type in your macOS password. So let me just type in my password and then click on the install software button. So once the software installation process is complete, the next thing you need to do is to go to your applications folder. So I'm just going to close out of the setup. Actually, I'll just move the uh, virtualbox.pkg file to my trash. So I'm just going to look for the virtualbox uh, launch icon, which is actually this one. So if you just double click on there, the VirtualBox uh, management window should actually open up. So from here, you can actually start to create and to provision virtual machines for your, to actually run on your MacBook. So here you can just set a name, you can select an ISO image file, you can choose the type of VM that you'd want to create. It can be a Windows based uh, virtual machine, or it can be a Linux based uh, virtual machine that you're actually looking to deploy. So that's a quick take and a quick look at how you can quickly install VirtualBox to quickly deploy multiple operating systems on your MacBook. I hope this tutorial has been informative and I'd like to thank you for viewing.